Hi guys, welcome back to the Artificer channel. Uh, today I want to continue on with the series to do with Orion figures. And today I've got a really exciting one to show you. This is the Viet Cong set from Orion figures, which is their take on the uh, North Vietnamese guerrilla forces fighting in the south. And I am really excited to show you uh, what's inside. You've got some great box art as always. So let's uh, open it up and let's have a look inside and see what we've got. Now again with any of these uh, type of sets you'll have most likely four sprues. Sometimes you'll have a mini sprue with some extra uh, interesting detailed figures. But looking at these figures from the get go uh, with a bit of a zoom in. I'm actually quite impressed with the detail. It's not as bad as the last set that I reviewed. And uh, you can definitely see some good detailing with the uh, weapons. I've got looks like some AK-47s. Uh, maybe an RPD, uh, looks like a Mosin 9 rifle or a Mosin. Uh, SKS rifles there as well. Nice to see that kind of uh, historical detail in there. A lot of uh, interesting weaponry. Another SKS, it looks like, or possibly a Mars French rifle. Uh, we've got some uh, Papa Shun 44s with uh, looks like an overly extended mag, which I think I might need to chop down. Uh, another SKS there, it looks like. And I believe that's a boom or a stick with uh, grenades that are meant to be on that. So not too fast. I think that guy could be maybe someone who was constructing something. So I like that. Uh, interesting figures as well pointing in directions as well. Uh, a lot of poses. And it looks like an RPG-2 as well, which is nice to see. And also uh, we've got some uh, farmer's style hats and local villager hats as well. Very, very uh, iconic of the Viet Cong. It's interesting because looking at these guys, they, they feel a lot more like NVA regular troops. Uh, they look quite organized. Not a lot of them are wearing bare feet, a lot of sandals on there. So perhaps these guys, these guys could be like an elite version of a, a Viet Cong unit. If you really want to get that kind of rustic look, you would go for the local communist forces as I, uh, as I showed you in one of my other previous videos. But yeah, look at that. We've got some issues there with the hat. Uh, unfortunately, that is a mold problem, which is going to run throughout the next uh, sprues. Uh, detail on the gun isn't too bad. The RPD looks a bit sketchy, but I believe that is something that can be ironed out later. Again, there's quite a good amount of detail, and I like, you, I like the fact you can actually see the sandals quite clearly on their feet, which I think is quite neat. Um, let's have a look at another sprue and see if there's the same consistency. And um, I think that one's a little bit better, actually. I uh, can see a lot more detail, uh, especially in the camera. But um, again, same problem with the machine gun there, uh, with the RPD. Uh, nice detailing, though, on that one. So, definitely a one that I would recommend. Definitely one to look out for. Great for any sort of dioramas you want to do in 172 scale. And to get that authentic feel to any troops that you've got attacking either South Vietnamese or American Army. Uh, US Marines, etc. So yeah, guys, that has been another wrap-up for Orion Figures. I am excited to find out some more and get some more kits to review for you next time. So, I will see you then.